Hi, my name is Ivan Browner from TSSA StormSafe. We're a professional glazing assessment company. Let me explain a little bit what, what that is. It's a little different than a glazing contractor who installs windows and door systems. A glazing analyst or glazing assessment company is a specified company that is trained to analyze damage that occurs on window systems in all kinds of events such as hurricanes, tornadoes, earthquakes, uh, tropical storms, uh, and, and we're called upon to do a specific type of investigation. That type of investigation works with other members of, of a team, such as a structural engineer, or a professional estimator, or a public adjuster, or sometimes a law firm. And what we do is we apply our knowledge base to go into a structure when glazing is a problem. We then do a multi-point inspection analyzing the system from how it's installed into the structure to how it's operating and how it's connected to itself. We do a battery of tests which will give an estimator or a professional engineer the, the data necessary for them to do their job, such as add windows to an insurance claim and, and estimate the cost of either replacing window systems or repairing window systems. Why would you need to use a window expert or a window analysis in, in, a, in an insurance claim? Well, it's simple. A structure has an envelope of protection. That is different components of a building. The roofing system, the cladding, the window systems are all envelope components. They're what's responsible to secure the, the interior of the structure, keep it safe, make sure that structure is able to handle pressure like a hurricane or a storm or a wind event, uh, snow or, or hail or anything that could damage that structure. Well, the interesting thing is, is that in a structure you have one roof, but you could have anywhere in a single family home, 12 windows, or a high rise building, hundreds of windows or thousands of windows. Or you have a, a, a storefront situation in a shopping mall, a, a, a commercial system, or a curtain wall system, which is in a, in a business environment, a, 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 a vertical structure that has an exterior glass facade. And the interesting thing about this is that when, when these forces act upon a building, they damage the roofs, they damage the window systems, they damage the facade, and specialists are called in to do specific types of investigations. Glazing systems are complicated. There are hundreds of window systems, there are hundreds of different types of, of, of fenestration products out there. Our expertise is knowing how those systems are installed, how they're put together, their strong points, their weak points, we have a whole library of data which we could research these systems. So we make sure we get in the hands of the other professionals on site uh, or in the team the knowledge that they need such as the performance of that window system. So the structural engineer can then take that data and, and do his mathematical wind modeling. So he knows where the failure points were, the causation of how that window was damaged. The estimator is going to look to us to give them the data necessary so they know could this system be repaired? Can it be replaced? How do they put numbers to those things? Because a repair is not just putting a caulk on a, on, a, on a window or a piece of glass. It has a lot of steps to it and each one of those steps needs to be well defined and well documented so when it's performed that structure is put back to its pre-loss condition and those window systems are now working the way they were intended. Sometimes they can't be repaired and replacement is the only option. Then we sit and we work with the professional engineer and the cost estimator and we talk about different code issues and, and what, what needs to be done to make sure that that building is now sustainable and is able to, to withstand another wind event. So these are some of the things that you're going to need to, to know when you um, employ the services of a glazing expert or, or a glazing contractor to come out and look at these buildings and, and if glass damage is an issue. The contractor is going to come in, the, the, the estimator might take a contractor and say, can you give me real world numbers so I can add to my estimate. They're going to look at it from a, a logistics point of view. 
The, the glazing analysis company is going to look at it from a damage point of view. They're going to look at it from bringing all of the facts together from their, in, their information from analyzing systems from past storm events, from different types of wind events, from, from hurricanes, from tornadoes, from earthquakes, from all kinds of different anomalies because window systems have a specific damage profile. Most of you, the homeowners or the building owners, are going to walk past your windows and not notice structural damage to window systems. You may, you may see things that you don't understand, and if they're not looked at and put into the claim, as much as you, as you repair a house, if that's not done, your building is still in jeopardy. Your structure is still in jeopardy. Your storefront is still in jeopardy. And when another storm comes through, the capacity of those windows are at a much lower level. So all of the damage that was repaired is going to get worse at a lower storm event. So these are some of the services that we are going to apply our trade to, to help you make sure that that structure is put back into its pre-loss condition. We have a saying, and that saying is a window is not just a piece of glass. For a long time, if you go up to someone and say, hey, what is a window? And someone says, oh, it's a piece of glass. You know, you look through a window, it's a glass. Well, it's not just a piece of glass. It is a complex system. And, and when you go to Home Depot or you go to Lowe's and you buy a window or you go to the window aisle and you see this completed box, it looks like a, it, it looks like a, a, a completed piece that you just pick up in one piece and you walk over and you, and, you, and you have it installed. But inside that, there's a lot of interconnecting parts. It's engineered in a certain way. It's designed in a certain way. Because of that, it damages in a certain way. And, and this damage is not always obvious. You know, if someone takes a rock and they throw it through your window and you have a broken piece of glass, well, you could say that, oh, there's a problem here. I think there's a problem here. Red alert, there's a, there's a broken piece of glass. But when wind acts upon a structure, if you don't have flying debris that breaks that piece of glass, you have other forces, uh, buffeting winds, three second gusts, movement of a building. <coughs> as, that, as that occurs, the damage that happens to the window system is not always visible that you're going to walk up and you're going to know. There's frame joints that get that gets loose. There's internal connection points to that window that start disrupting or rotating from each other. There's separation that's seen at the intermediate locking mechanisms of the window, which is the point where the two window systems in a single hung window, you go to your window, you lift it up, <coughs> one part of the window moves, the other part of the window stays stationary. The interlocking or intermediate section is the center of that window. What happens is that buffeting wind moves that glass. Both parts of these windows move interdependently of each other. Then you have bowing and, and separation of those joints. Well, all of a sudden, that window exhibits signs of failure. But you're not going to know it because you're not trained to understand what failure is. And a lot of times, it's this type of in-depth analysis that's going to find those hidden damages. We, we utilize a series of, of, of different types of tests from a, a non-invasive visual assessment with a specially trained group of, of, of glazing analysts, or we can get an invasive testing, which has to do with bringing a spray rack in conjunction with a structural engineer. And and showing where the failure points are on that window. We can emulate the effects of a storm event and we could put that window under pressure and stress and get real world data that can be run through a calculative analysis to show what this window was designed to perform and where it failed. And that information is then put into an estimate. So it's a complex step-by-step -step analysis and it's finding these small damages which most people are not going to realize and making sure the professional team that you have assembled has that data at their, at their disposal. And these are the types of tests that we're going to perform as a team to help put your structure back into its pre-loss condition.